Tonight, a cautionary tale to all parents and their children. Two sets of 12-year-old boys reported a man following and possibly trying to kidnapping them from a park in Culver City. Fox 11 Susan Hirasun is live with more on this. Susan, very scary. Yeah, imagine that you're walking near a park and you notice that van following you and then pull up ahead of you park. The driver comes out and opens the rear doors. Well, that was enough to set off alarm bells for a few students, a couple students here at Culver City Middle School, and now everyone is on the lookout. Students at Culver City Middle and High Schools had more to talk about than the three-day holiday weekend. It was like three of my friends. They tried to kidnap them. Culver City police detectives are investigating two reports of 12-year-olds being followed in the Lindbergh Park area near Culver City Middle School. Darian Boyd claims to know them. They said that, like, the guy who kept, like, he kept driving up and stopped in front of them. He kept doing that over and over again. And then they ran back to the house and called their, um, and their mom caught the police. Police say the juveniles reported being followed by a white man with messy hair driving a work van with tinted windows, multiple dents, and no license plate. In one instance, the boys noticed the driver get out and open the rear doors. Police say the students started walking in the opposite direction. Very smart and changed the, 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 the side of the road. So I, I feel that they were doing the exact right thing. The school district sent out an email to notify parents. Totally shocked. I don't think I've heard about something like this in years. Just tells me like watch out like for my surroundings more. This couple at Lindbergh Park were aware of the attempted kidnapping and kept a very close eye on their toddler, yet Wendy Tahara refuses to be too paranoid. You know, it happens anywhere. I'm not really freaked out. It's, that, it doesn't really surprise me because this could happen anywhere, honestly. So, I mean, any town, anywhere. Right. Indeed, a lot of people here in Culver City, they kind of feel like they're a little bit away from Los Angeles, but indeed they think they realize rather that this is a part of the Los Angeles area. So even the bad things can happen here in Culver City. Now the case is ongoing. Detectives continue to investigate, but for sure, lots of people are on the lookout for that gray work van. Reporting live in Culver City, Susan Hirasuna, Fox 11 News. Very